Can you hear me? Is it on? Can you see me? Yeah, Mom, it's on. You just need to turn the camera around. How do I do that? The little camera with the arrows in the corner. Can you see it? Press that and it will turn it around. Stupid machine burn thing. <sighs> stupid thing. Why do you have to make me use this stupid phone, Leah? You know why, Mum. Back in the day, we actually talked to each other face to face, went round to the neighbours and had tea rather than speak through text and emojis. When did you have tea with the neighbours? Pretty sure you don't even know their names. <sighs> yeah, and whose fault is that? Maybe I was about to go and introduce myself before you locked me in and made me a prisoner in my own home. You're not a prisoner, Mum. You just need to isolate yourself for a bit. Everyone is. It's to keep you safe and well, and then you can go meet the neighbours in a few weeks if you want. It's ridiculous. I didn't fight in the war to have the government tell me where I can and can't go. I fought for freedom. You didn't fight in the war. You were three when it ended. What's the principle? How are you, though? Did you get the care package I sent you? I put some extra tea bags in for you and some Jaffa cakes too as a treat. Yeah, yeah, I got them all. Reagan ate most of the Jaffa cakes. What do you mean, Reagan ate them? Well, she and Ronnie came round this morning to see us. They came round? Yeah, and it was very nice to see them, face to face, rather than over the Who's app. What's that? But Mum, listen, you can't have people coming around. Not at the moment, you know that. Family don't count. They do count. Well, it was lovely to see them, and lovely to know they at least are thinking about me. Do you mean? Well, you've not been over in how long? Weeks. You're only a few streets away. You don't want to see me. You, you only talk to me through the, the who's it phone. Hang on, I'm going to call them. We can't have this. Hey, sis. Hello, what is it? Hi. Did you guys go around to mum's house today? Well, straight to the point then. Yeah, we did. Mm-hmm. She's in isolation. We're supposed to be social distancing. You can't just do that. Yes, they can. They're welcome any time, my best girls. Hi, Mum. Hi, yeah. Uh... Look, Mum's very vulnerable right now, and we don't want anything to happen to her, so we have to be extra careful. Vulnerable? Says who? Just because I've got a bit of bloody asthma, I'm fine. Leah, you're worrying about nothing. <sighs> Right? And look, you know what she's like, and I really needed the check, so... You went over to ask for money? Yeah, for the restaurant. Look, this is really hitting us hard, and it, who knows when the government are going to pull their finger out and actually give us something. And so Mum just offered a donation, you know, to keep us afloat. Happy to help, sweetheart. Yeah, thanks, Mum. Love you. Look, I've really got to go. I'll, I'll speak to you later, all right? I've got to go as well, but thanks for the check too, Mum. She gave you money too. Why do you need it? Because I work things. You're a bank manager who's working from home. You don't need any money. Well, she can treat herself to something then. Thank you, Mum. Right, no, enough. You can't be asking for money. I know it's a hard way of time. I get it. I do. All my gigs have been cancelled and I'm... Oh, yeah. It's hardly the same thing, is it, Leah? I mean, my business could go under. I'm self-employed and I don't exactly get sick pay, Ronnie. But mum's retired now and we need to think about her health. I'm fine. Stop talking about me as if I'm some ageing invalid. Look, I've really got to go, all right? Look, we can talk about this another time. See you later. Ronnie, wait. Uh, me too. Ciao for now. Love you lots. Bye. Ciao. Mum. Enough from you. I won't have you disparaging your sisters. They're the only ones who bothered to come and see me. Make sure I'm all right. I call you every day. Well, it's not good enough, Cordelia. If you can't be bothered to come and see me, don't even bother calling anymore. You don't put the effort in, you don't get any out. Nothing comes of nothing. I'm done with you. But, Mum, I'm doing it for you.